I want to welcome you to the wedding ceremony, Rachel Ann Emerson to Alex Logan Hutto. It is said that a soulmate is someone you connect with in a uniquely powerful way. It's a connection so strong that you're drawn to them in a way you've never experienced before. As this connection develops over time, you experience a love so deep and so complex that you begin to doubt whether you have truly loved before. so many conversations, so many dates, that somewhere along the line, love sparked inside of both of you. And that spark became a flame. And that flame burns deep today. You have both realized that God meant for you to spend your one lifetime together. You both have chosen. And you both have been chosen. Alex, Rachel is not just a first round pick. She is the first pick of the first round. Amen? You have chosen wisely. Rachel, Alex is one of the most unique young men I've ever met. And I believe that you will never regret making him your prince for life. I ask each of you to write something about what you love most about one another. I want to read that now. What I love about Rachel. I love how you always bring the best out of me. I love the way you love the Vols and are learning to love Duke for me. It's very hard for me to read. <laughs> I love that you rather go to a football game than to the opera or shopping. I love that you are so driven, and I love how you always strive to do the best job possible in everything that you do. I love that you cared about us as a family so much that you saved money for three years to make it possible for us to buy a house together. I love that being with your family is so easy. I love that your dad thinks he can beat me at one-on-one -on -one in basketball. Now, I must admit, Dad, this is the strangest uh, thing that's ever been on a list. I love that you saved yourself for me, as I have saved myself for you. I love that you love God first, and I love that you love me unconditionally. I love that you are an answer to my prayers. And I love that you are my bride today. I love you, Rachel Ann Emerson. Rachel, here's what you said. Alex, I love you for your love for the Lord and how you share your testimony to help others grow in their relationship with Christ. I love the way you love your family. And I love how they've always taken me in with open arms. I love how you love all of my family and that you have a strong relationship with every one of them. I love how spontaneous you are, even though I like to always have a plan you help me get out of my comfort zone and live. I love how hard you've worked through school and in your career to provide 
for me and our future family. I love how you always try to love whatever I love, whatever I enjoy. At least I love that you act like it. I love your huge heart for people. This has helped me become a more compassionate person. And I love how you encourage me and you push me to chase my dreams. I love you, Alex Sato, because you have become my biggest cheerleader. of the gospel of Jesus Christ and according to the laws of the great state of Tennessee. I now pronounce you husband and wife. So Alex, for the very first time, I'm going to kiss your wife. Woo!